Polly Baca is a great inspiration to me. I've had the great honor of serving as the first Latina speaker in the history of Colorado. Um, but long before I was able to serve as a legislator, it was Polly Baca that was trailblazing on behalf of all Latinas across the country. Polly has been a tireless advocate when it comes to civil rights and educational equity. Um, she's always working on thinking about how do we make sure that the voices and values of all people are well represented. She was a person who, when deterred at various issues, and she was often deterred because of you know, race and gender and the old world values of the 50s and 60s, she was often turned away from things that she was trying to do for the greater good. She'd be turned away and she'd find another way. And I would think that you would be hard pressed to find anybody better than Polly Baca, who epitomizes what the mission of the land grant school is, developing opportunities through education for uh, people that might not have the greatest access. She was such a great inspiration to me because of all of the work that she has been able to accomplish on behalf of all the people of our state. When I decided to run for state representative, Polly was one of my very early supporters and always gave me great advice to be able to win that first race and ultimately become Speaker of the House. Um, you know, she was a trailblazer long before I ever had the opportunity to be able to serve. Um, I can't think of anybody who is more deserving of this award from the Colorado State University. So congratulations, Polly, on behalf of the entire General Assembly you are an inspiration to us all.